If you're looking into buying a modded account or a money booster for GTA 5 Need for Speed Forza Horizon, check out HyperResupply.com. They sell modded accounts and money boosters for all platforms on all those games. And they have the best cheap, fast, reliable services than any other company out there. Also, HyperResupply.com has 5 star reviews. Also, HyperResupply.com is a verified company with verified reviews. You should buy it from HyperResupply.com. They sell modded accounts, money boosters, and modded cars like this for old gen and new gen. You can buy an account that has over 100 vehicles, over 1,000 examples of these modded cars that you can buy from. And also, if you want to save even more money, go over to the checkout and use code REBEL for 10% off your next order. Yo, what's up everyone? I will be showing you on the latest clothing glitches that are working right now in GTA 5 Online. And as the video does go on, each clothing glitch does get better and better. Also, don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you're new, turn on the bell notification as well. Let's not waste any more time and let's get straight into the video. For the first clothing glitch, I will be showing you on how to get a white body armor with invisible arms with black joggers. Now this also does stick. So make a way over to any clothing store on the map. Go over to the front counter. Now save your current outfit on slot number 20. Now get rid of all your other outfits. Then you will need to open up your pause menu. Go over to online. Go over to swap character and accept the alert that shows up on your screen. Now you should be loading into a small room like this. Hover above the second slot character and push edit. Now if it says something about copying a rank over it, just accept the alert. Now if it's a female character on edit, just go over to save and continue. And if it's a male character on the second slot, just go over to the edit, go over to sex and put it a female and push save and continue. And basically that will be putting you into a random GTA 5 online lobby like this. Now you will need to make your way over to any clothing store on the map. Go over to the accessories and make sure you remove any sort of accessories that is on the female character. Now go over to the gloves and purchase the light woolen tactical gloves. These right here. Now you will need to go over to the pants section now on the pants you will need to go over to the utility pants and purchase the black battle pants these right here now go over to the tops now on the tops find the section called the tactical jackets and purchase the khaki tactical blossom it should be the last one available now stay at the tops go over to the bikinis and purchase the black bikini. Now go over to the front counter. And make sure you save this as an outfit on slot number 2. After you've done that. You will need to make your way back over to the top section. And once you're there. You will need to go over to the work jacket. And buy the peach camo clothes field. This one right here. Now stay at the top still, go over to the gun running t-shirts, and buy the gray digital road tee. Now you will need to make your way over to the pants. Go over to the sport pants and purchase the first one. It is called the spotted muscle pants. These right here. Now go over to the shoe section. Go over to the high heel boots. And purchase the Deluxe Midnight Combat. Now go over to the front counter. And make sure you save this as an outfit on slot number 3. Now go over to the saved outfits and select them a couple times each. Then back off from the front counter. You will need to open up your interaction menu. Choose the option to easy way out. And basically that will be spawning you outside of the clothing store. And once you do spawn in, open up your pause menu, go over to online, go over to creator, and accept the alert that shows up on the screen like this. 
Now you should see a blue menu like this on your screen. Now go over to create a race, click tutorial and accept that alert that shows up on your screen. Now wait about like five or six seconds. Now open up your pause menu, go over to online, go over to choose character and accept that alert that shows up on your screen once again. Now you will be loading into a small room like this. Hover above the second slot character, which is the female and make sure you delete her. After you do delete her, hover above the first slot character, which is the male, and return to GTA 5. Now, that will be putting you into the GTA 5 story mode. And once you do load into story mode like this, open up your pause menu. Once you do load into story mode, open up your pause menu, go over to online and load into a invite only session so you can load into a lobby quicker. Now, once you do load into a lobby, just make your way over to any clothing store on the map. Go over to the front counter and make sure you save your current outfit on slot number 20. Now, stay at the front counter still. You will need to find the section called the biker suits and buy the black biker suit. This one right here. Now open up your pause menu, go over to online and start up the mission called It's a G Thing. Now there will be a link down below in the video description on how to bookmark it. Now that job works on all platforms. Now once you do start it up, you will be loading into a job menu like this. On the clothing, make sure you put it on player saved outfits. And invite at least one person to help you out. And once they do join, just launch the mission. Now you should be loading into a second job menu like this. On the owned outfits, click two to the right. Now both of y'all ready to up as well. So the mission could start. Now once you do load into the mission. Now get inside of any of these vehicles that are next to you. Doesn't matter which one and make your way over to your apartment building and it doesn't matter which apartment building it is it won't show up on the map just go over to it though now make your way inside go over to the closet area and you could save this as an outfit on any slot it doesn't really matter to be honest then back out from the closet area quit the job to the jobs list through your phone and that will be putting you into a random gta 5 online lobby like this and basically, once you do load in, just apply the saved outfit we just made and you should see your saved outfit appear like this. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you're new, and let's not waste any more time and let's move on to the other clothing glitch of this video. So for this clothing glitch, I will be showing you on how to get multiple different color Tron shoes. Now, make your way over to any clothing store on the map. Now go over to the front counter. Now you need to find the section called the deadline outfits and purchase any one that you do like and save this as an outfit. It doesn't matter which slot. Now go over to the bodysuits and purchase any bodysuit as well. Now make your way over to the nearest telescope so you can do the telescope glitch. Now once you're at the telescope, Run past the telescope, hitting right on the D-pad and pull away from the telescope. Open up your interaction menu and apply the saved outfit we just made once. Close the interaction menu and walk away from the telescope and you should see the bodysuit merge underneath the Tron outfit like this. Now make your way over to the mask store once you're done. Now go over to the t-shirt stand. Now on the t-shirt stand you will need to go over to the sports t-shirts and purchase any of the first five. Now back out from the mask store and you should see you have the Tron shoes like this. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you're new. Catch you on tomorrow's video. Peace.